One of the great things about force is that if you're a guitarist like me or you're a singer-songwriter, it's really easy to record and loop your ideas using the instrument and microphone inputs on the back of the device. So I've already been recording some loops and I've recorded some acoustic guitar with a microphone, but I'm using the instrument input to record some electric guitar. So I'm going to walk you through the whole process right now. So if I go to the mixer and go to the inserts, I've already got uh, an electric guitar effects chain loaded up. but I'm just going to sort of walk you through how I built this and uh, how you can do it yourself. So I'm just going to go through the whole process from the start by just adding a new track, which is an audio track. I'm going to arm it for recording and select input one. I'm going to turn on auditioning here so that I can hear the raw electric guitar tone. And then what I'm going to do is just start adding some of the amazing plugin effects from Air Music Technology. So I can add four of these and I'm just going to start by adding in a delay, air delay. So here's the GUI. So the mix is a little bit high, I'm just going to take that down slightly. And I'm going to choose a time that's a little bit more appropriate, 1 8th. There we go, that should work. Sounds about right. So I'm just also going to load a few more effects just to give you a feel for what they sound like. Uh, I really like the reverb, so I'm just going to load that in. And I'm just going to change the mix just a little bit. sounds really, really nice to me. Now what I'm going to do is go back out. I'm just going to turn off the recording for a moment and I'm going to go to matrix mode. So to record this part in, all we have to do is launch our clips and then I'm going to turn on record arm on that track and then just tap the clip and I can just start recording. Now all I have to do is go into that clip. Now that I've recorded and trimmed that clip in real time, I'm just going to go to my other guitar part and just add some more with it. So this is a straightforward, it's just launching the clips and playing along. Once you've recorded these parts, you can also just simply copy them along. And I can just launch them into a new section. <laughs> 